I'd like to introduce uh, Greg Sommer. He's the CEO of Sandstone Diagnostics. Uh, Sandstone is working to build tools that help people uh, live healthier like everybody else, but with a unique emphasis on improving your chances of conception as a family and starting a family. Um, and they're doing this a little bit differently than others, and we've shown a number of companies in the fertility space, uh, but this attacks the other side of the fertility equation, which is typically focused on women, and looks at men's reproductive health. Um, and it looks at men's reproductive health in terms of what men can actually do to improve uh, their sperm count and their sperm quality. Um, and this is now done through an easy-to-use easy at-home kit. So I get to finally have somebody on stage at Health 2.0 who's going to talk about sperm. <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> <laughs> Twitter goes wild. Anyway, <laughs> with that, Greg. Thank you so much. It's really a pleasure to be here to tell you what Sandstone's doing in the area of consumer health and fertility improvement to help people conceive. So this is TRAC, the male fertility tracker. This is a device that allows couples to measure, monitor, and improve a man's sperm quality from the comfort of a home. Quickly show you how it works. This is a device in disposable test cartridges. Man simply collects a sample. You put a few drops into the device, close the lid, and if you can see that, it's spinning. And what we are doing is we're using centrifugal force to isolate the sperm cells and give the couples a reading of sperm count, which is measured in millions of cells per milliliter. Uh, this product will be available over the counter beginning next year. The other part of the product that I want to show you is the Track mobile app. Uh, and with this tool, users are able to go in, log their results. Uh, if we can pull up the app, but not coming up. Sorry. Oh, there we go. Perfect. So you can come in, log your results, both using the track results as well as laboratory semen analysis, put your numbers in, learn about what they mean, see how you stack up, uh, see changes over time. And then we also have a health and lifestyle monitoring tool. But we're focused on those areas of a man's life that could be causing fertility concerns. So you can see things like diet and exercise, stress. Heat exposure is a big one, so we want to know how what you're exposed to in your life, and we can take that data and we can give you personalized guidance on what the concerns might be, and more importantly, tips on what you can do to improve your quality. Uh, now, at the risk of getting too personal on a Tuesday morning, I want to tell you about my sperm count. So, <laughs> earlier this year, I was a little overweight, these pants didn't fit, so I uh, decided to get back into better shape, and since I have a home sperm counter, I thought, well, let me see if, uh, if this works at all. And, oh, if you can go back to the app, I want to show my data here in the app. Uh, we'll get to the website in a second. But this is my data. Uh, so briefly, what you need to know is that over the course of about 100 days, I uh, lost over 15 pounds, and in doing so, nearly doubled my sperm count. Um, thank you, yeah. <laughs> To give you a little context here, when I started, I was right around the average amongst the healthy population. And where I'm at now, well, I don't, uh, I don't like to brag, but it's pretty high. <laughs> <laughs> I'm also happy to share that my wife and I are expecting our second child this winter. Yeah. <laughs> we couldn't be more excited. But this is really what makes what we're doing so powerful and innovative. Gentlemen, your sperm count is not set in stone. A couple of months of of healthier living, being mindful about what you're doing in your life can make a dramatic impact, and this can be the difference between getting pregnant and not getting pregnant, be between being a father and not being a father. That's incredibly powerful. We believe that men have long been vastly underserved in the fertility space, and we want to take that back and give guys the tools they need to do their part to improve a couple's chances of conception. I only have a few seconds left. I want to show you our website. So I enjoy the talk about the importance of consumer education in this space. Couldn't be more true for men's reproductive health. We're talking about sperm and testicles and semen and all sorts of things. So we've built the online hub for information. You can check us out at don'tcookyourballs.com. <laughs> Everything that you want to know about men's sexual and reproductive health is here. I encourage you to check it out. There's an online tool that you can take. It takes about 10 minutes. Put in your information, see what you're doing in your life. That could be a little bit better, a little bit more sperm friendly. My time's up. We're Sandstone Diagnostics. The product is tracked. The website is don'tcookyourballs.com. Uh, we're helping guys become fathers, and we do it in kind of a fun way. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you.